this video, we'll be seeing how to set up Flutter on Windows. Go to flutter.div and click get started and you can select Windows. You have to download the Flutter SDK files. After finishing the download, you have to go to the folder where it is downloaded and extract it. After that, you have to place this folder somewhere safe. I'm going to keep it on the C drive, paste it there. Now you have got the Flutter SDK files downloaded and placed on the C drive. Now you have to add an environment variable uh, so that you could easily uh, access Flutter from anywhere. So you have to copy the path for that. Uh, you have to go to the Flutter Flutter folder and then go to bin. Then from there copy the path. Then search for environment variable. Then add a new path. It's new and you can add a new path and click enter ok ok and ok that's it now you have added the flutter to uh, your windows now you have to set up an ide so we are using visual studio for this download visual studio for windows you could go to code.visualstudio.com After downloading go to the downloaded folder double click and install it after finishing installation just launch it Now we have successfully installed Visual Studio Code. Now we have to install the Flutter extension for Visual Studio Code. Now go to extension and search for Flutter. You have to install it. I have already installed it. Just uh, in case you want to see, I'll just uninstall it and show you. Uh, now there will be an install button here. Just click it. That's all. Flutter is installed. Extension. Now we have to install another extension that is Dart. Dart is a programming language in which Flutter is working. You have to install that one too. After installing both extensions, you are ready to go with creating a Flutter project. Select a folder. Now I am creating a new folder. And just drag and drop it here. Now you have just opened the folder to Visual Studio Code. Now you have to open the terminal. Click the option terminal and new terminal and you will get the terminal. Now for creating the Flutter uh, application, you have to type Flutter 
space create and your project name so i am giving it as sample project and press enter now you could see that flutter project is been created now the application have successfully created now you could write your codes to a file na named main dot dot that's where it is usually kept so for that you have to open the folder your project name and then lib then main dot dot this is a file which contains all the programming parts of the dot programming this is done with dot language and that's it now if you want to have a look at the demo application just launch a emulator and run it let's run it on a emulator and see i have opened my emulator here and let's run this application and see for that you have to first of all uh, move to your project folder that is sample project to the terminal for that type cd space and the project name sample project now for running just type flutter run Now you could see the application is running. Now this is a demo application which is pre-built in. Now that's all for this video. I hope this video helped you.